Isn't she gorgeous? She's so pretty. So pretty. So this is my orchid. I don't know what kind of orchid it is. I'm not an orchid expert by any means. Not even an expert. I'm sorry, not even an orchid novice. Like I don't know much about orchids. Um, I actually have more luck with other people's orchids and I'll tell you why. I bought an orchid for myself and I bought another one for my boss who was an orchid, she collects orchids. So we had both of them in the office getting the same light. I took care of both of them. Mine died a slow, painful for both of us death. Hers bloomed every six months. It was gorgeous and I have no idea why. They had the same everything and so I took care of both of them. <laughs> I don't know. But orchids are actually beautiful and eventually they will lose all of their flowers and then you will cut back the stem and then you just let them be for a long time and eventually another spike will grow and you'll get more flowers. So they're absolutely gorgeous. I love them. They are, they are not too excited to get too much water. So this is literally what I water my orchid in once a week. That's all it gets. And so far so good. So far so good. Keep our fingers crossed. So I love my orchid. I have not named my orchid yet. So if you would like to put in some suggestions for my orchid to have a name, go for it. Maybe we should call it Lucky. <laughs> we can hope, right? I love my orchid. So I found some beautiful crochet patterns for flowers, which I thought you might really like today because, you know, orchid. So I'm going to start off with the crochet moth orchid pattern. It is available on Etsy and it is a stunner. It is absolutely gorgeous. If, if, if my orchid doesn't make it, I might have to just go this route because it's absolutely beautiful and I love it. So this pattern is $7.51. Again, Pippa Patterns Crochet. She's amazing. I've so far fallen in love with this designer. So check her out. Uh, like I said, Pippa Patterns Crochet, and this is the Moth Orchid. And actually, it looks a lot like mine, so maybe it's a Moth Orchid. If you know what kind of orchid this is, let me know in the comments below, because I'd love to know. It didn't come with a tag. So, Okay, next pattern idea coming up. Okay, the next flower I have is just super funny. I think it's hysterical. I think you're going to think so too. So this is like, I don't know. They call it a man-eating plant. To me, it looks like a Venus flytrap, but I love that it's eating the man. <laughs> if you take a close look at the picture, you can see the one flower. It actually does have the man's legs sticking out like he's struggling. It's so funny. So this is by Kraka. That's the name of the store. It is a $5.54 pattern and it is absolutely hysterical. I love it. I think it's so funny. My son saw it and he's like, mom, you've got to make that. <laughs> okay, we've got one more pattern left and it is another orchid. So let me just grab it here. Now this one is a video, I believe. Let me just double check. I believe it's a video tutorial. I could be lying. I hope I'm not. I could have sworn it was a video. Okay, it is a video. So it's a video and they have it in English and also I believe Italian. So um, the links are right there. Um, just scroll down until you find English though. There's part one and part two. It is absolutely beautiful. But I'm glad there's a video tutorial because it looks a little tricky a little tricky so all right I hope you are enjoying this series as much as I am I am absolutely having a blast uh, showing you all of my plant friends and showing you all of my fun crochet plant ideas I've actually been adding to this board for several months because I didn't think anybody else would be interested in it but I've loved it um, so I hope you're interested in it I hope you like it as much as I do uh, we've only got a couple days. This is day 13. We've got two days left. So 
I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.